my name is Juma K. Dada, and I am the owner of Signature Red, and today we hosted Rose Girls Philly. It was a great event, we had a great turnout, and um, I'm just happy to see that so many women are excited about learning how to code. Uh, Rails Girls originated in Finland and we decided to bring it to Philadelphia because of just the need to get more women involved with coding. So today we were uh, teaching Ruby on Rails. Uh, Rails is the web application framework um, that uses the Ruby programming language and uh, the participants got started by building their own application, uh, following an example, a tutorial, and by the end of the day hopefully most of them had uh, a working application they had seen what the application structure is like, and they had migrated their databases and modified their views. And uh, some of them, even at the end of the day, were going off on their own and adding new features to that app. We learned how to create an app with Ruby on Rails. We learned the basics of using GitHub and also Heroku. And I also like that we learned kind of very basic programming language skills. Programming is a word we use when we talk about how people talk to computers. Ruby actually is kind of a magical language because you can usually just tell it things and it usually works. <laughs> and that's one of the reasons why Ruby is so fun to write. Your framework helps you out and keeps you from having to rewrite the same thing over and over. Or, you know, you don't have to just write your own framework that you make open source means that you can look under the hood and contribute back to it so you can help make it better. The thing I really like the most is that we learn kind of what are the pieces that you need to create a kind of full web-based product. What are kind of the pieces of web infrastructure? I don't have enough superlatives to explain what a great organization this is. It's a great way to learn a really difficult language um, among other people who are sort of in the same boat. Um, what's really cool is you actually leave with sort of some working parts that you can see on your browser and you're like, wow, I actually created that. And that makes you want to go back and maybe say, yeah, maybe I'll edit this, maybe I'll change that, maybe I'll go online and see what else I can add. So it was really pretty satisfying. I also like the fact that it was very informal. It wasn't as if like a sit down or this is a school, I'm a teacher, you're a student sort of a thing. Something that helped me immensely was going through the installation party yesterday because uh, I had a lot of trouble installing and uninstalling things but then just having people around to help. That was really great. I thought that Rails Girls was hands down the best one day educational experience in any field. Um, I really liked how there was a combination of large group learning with the small group dynamics that you got with the coaches. I like that everything was pretty much immediately hands-on. They gave you the directions and then you can dive right in. I like that you end with a clear end product. You can go home and say, this is this app I made. It's online already. And then I also like that they include follow-up. With Rails Girls, they had a clear, you know, here is our next meetup. Here are other opportunities in Philadelphia for you to get more knowledge so that you don't just kind of let your skills fall by the wayside. The best part for me was meeting all these people. I'm so inspired. The women around me, some of them haven't ever coded or pro done programming in their life, but then they're so excited about it. It is very empowering as a woman to you know, see things like these happening. I was so pleased with how many uh, female participants we had today, and I hope that uh, it leads a lot of them to be able to you know, produce apps for fun, or maybe even uh, start into a career in uh, web development. I really was pleased by uh, seeing people's faces light up when uh, I, we were able to show them their application that they wrote on, uh, on a public facing site. That was really nice. I will absolutely attend another one, another Rails workshop and I would recommend that you check these out as well in your, in your city. And I think it went really well and I think that we're going to have some great coders in the making and I was just happy to host it. So we hope that everyone enjoyed themselves and stay tuned for more events from Signature Red.